There's only one thing to say here. Everyone's going. Avengers! Assemble! Assemble! Assemble. Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another daily dose of Disney. I slept so good last night. These beds are extremely, extremely comfortable. Today, we're headed to a California adventure. Down below is going to be my affiliate code and the affiliate link for you to save 15 to 20% here at the Howard Johnson. Again, big shout out to them for um, hosting us here. Let's head on over to uh, California Adventure and go into Avengers Campus for the very first time here. Got my Spidey shirt on. I'm ready. It is so beautiful out. It's 68 degrees, no humidity. Perfect. It is supposed to heat up today. We're getting a heat wave here in California. Go figure. Yesterday was 90. It's supposed to be 90 here today as well. We should be in front of California Adventure in about five minutes. It's a lovely stroll. This is the closest I've ever stayed to uh, California Adventure and at Disneyland. Now the park opens at eight. It is 7.15 right now. I don't really know how many people show up early. So we'll have to wait and see. Um, I don't know if they work, open the park like 30 minutes early, an hour early. I don't really know, but we decided to leave as soon as we got the Spider-Man web slingers. We're group 19. It's pretty good. And it's all thanks to Jojo. <laughs> and we've made it. Lovely five minute walk. Not bad at all. And it is uh, seeming pretty crowded right now. Um, there's a big stream of people coming on in here in the morning. We could have came a little bit earlier, but you know, it's not the end of the world. <laughs> Theme park reservation is required. They actually did just drop a lot more capacity. It's relatively easy, just like Disney World, to get a reservation now. Um, there is no annual pass holders over here, so it's just, you know, you have to buy a ticket every single day. But it's very easy, and it does look like they might be holding us off at security before they let us on into, like, the main hub into uh, Disneyland or California, whichever park you choose. Scratch that. Just kidding. They are letting us go on in, and then, uh, I guess, maybe line up for a California adventure. A quick look at the lines here. I don't really know when they open up. It is 7.23 here in the morning. We technically are here for rope drop. There's actually more people lined up for Disneyland than California Adventure right now at the morning. Oh my gosh, you can see the Disneyland Railroad. You can actually hear it from our hotel, but I haven't seen that running in forever because it's not up at Disney World. This will be tomorrow's adventure. We actually might get some in this video as well because we did get park hopping tickets. We don't know. We're just going to have a full day of a lot of fun, so expect a very long video. I mean, we're at Disneyland after all. Shoot, they're opening up the gates for California Adventure, I gotta get over here. Oh, snap. <laughs> here we go, 7.30 in the morning, 30 minutes before uh, their open time, so technically, we are rope dropping. Hello. Good. We good? Oh, cool, all right. Thank you, thank you. We are in, everybody. The first time here in the longest time. Oh, I need a ticket? Thank you. Woo! All right. JoJo was just telling me this is technically our first time here in two years, basically, since we were able to ride uh, the rides. We were obviously here for the, the Touch of Disney event the first day, but we weren't able to ride any of the rides. We get to ride rides today. It's obviously open. It does look like we have to choose what direction we want to go to. We want to, if we go down, um, is it Sunset? Hollywood Boulevard, or if we're going to head straight on in, and then we'd be able to go to Avengers, Pixar Pier, Cars Land. I made a decision that we're going to go this way. We're going to head to Cars Land, Pixar Pier, and then we'll go to uh, the Web Slingers and probably Guardians. I think this is a lot better route. So this is traditional rope drop. They brought this back last month, similar to when uh, Disney World brought their traditional rope drop back. They will be dropping the ropes at 8 o'clock, so we have 20 minutes to wait here, and uh, everyone's going to pile on up. I think this is the best way to go this way just because um, there's more attractions this way. Oh, no. oh, Here we go. Oh my God. All right. They're not walking anyone. Oh, they're sprinting. There's only one thing to say here. Everyone's going. Avengers! Assemble. 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 Holy no, cow. Looks like Avengers Campus isn't quite open oh yet. Everyone's going to so cars, everyone's Kyle. going to cars. Oh my gosh. Wow. You have to come in the morning. There's nothing like the excitement of everybody rushing on to whatever ride they want to go to. It looks like Cars Land. Avengers Campus isn't open quite yet, so everyone's choosing to go to Cars, which is probably the best thing to do. Then we're probably going to go to Pixar Pier to hopefully try to get another walk on it. It's going to be insanely packed here today. I just want to go to Avengers Campus soon. 
Soon, soon, soon. It's a lot of people. <laughs> this is worse than Disney World Rope Drop. There's just like, just you know, it's it's nuts. Yeah. Um, it says Radiator Springs is a 45 minute wait already, and we were at the front. We have a developing story right now. Uh, they're boarding groups one through 18 for web web slingers. We are 19. So we're gonna be like the next boarding group to be called to be able to get in line to the brand new ride, the Marvel's Avengers Campus, the whole new area. We don't know if you have an hour after yours has been called, similar to Rise of Resistance, that's what we're kind of assuming. Um, we should be able to get there after. I mean, there's no way we missed our boarding group, but we're pretty much next. Just ask the cast member back there. He says you have an hour after your boarding group has been called, so we have plenty of time. That's probably gonna be the next thing we actually hit, which is exciting. I'm so excited for uh, this ride, but all I can think about is we're going to Avengers Campus for the first time after this. Oh my God. This was about a 20 minute wait for us in the morning. 20 minute wait for Rope Drop. Not bad. Um, if you don't know, this one's exactly kind of like Test Track, but a lot better. Say it with me, everybody. Ka ciao. Oh, I love this. So nice. A great way to wake up in the morning, everyone. Woo! Oh, yeah. Don't let Frank catch you. I love that part. Oh! Radio Springs. The champion needs speed and style. Luigi, you are your best. Uh oh, here we go. Getting new tires. Getting race tires. Hey. I mean, you're going. Time for the moment I've been waiting for, and I think most of you, we're gonna step foot for the first time in Avengers Campus and go on a Spider-Man Web Slingers. Here we are, everybody, now stepping foot into Avengers Campus for the very first time. <laughs> Dun 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 na, na, na. I wonder why they have this blocked off. Interesting. Dun, dun. It doesn't seem as busy in the morning, obviously because it is a virtual line, so there's really no need to be in Avengers Campus until your boarding group gets called, like Aura's dead. And there's, the cool thing about Avengers Campus, as you guys probably have seen, there's so much entertainment. We're gonna check that out a little bit later. I just wanna get on Web Slingers and um, then I'll show you guys Avengers Campus here. I haven't really looked at much stuff, but I do know this is one of the coolest things ever. We're gonna catch a lot of these shows a little bit later. They don't have to start happening until about 10, 15, it's 8.43. So that's where we're gonna head on uh, Web Slingers for the first time and kind of enjoy the ride. It's quite the long line for a virtual queue already. I heard it's about an hour wait. Oh, it's so cool to be here. This is what Galaxy's Edge should be. Very immersive with so much entertainment. This whole area is bigger than I had originally thought, and the music is so, so immersive. It really puts you into Avengers Campus. It, it feels like you're in the movie. <laughs> By any chance that you don't, make sure you follow my Instagram and Facebook for live updates inside the parks before it hits the vlog. So if you guys don't, you get an early look um, on my Instagram and Facebooks. So this is something different for a boarding group. We have to do a view entry code. And it's a QR code that they're gonna scan. Dunks have those boarding passes out, please. Yeah. Now, if you have no idea what this ride is, it's a Spider-Man ride. It's similar kind of to a uh, Toy Story Midway Mania. I haven't looked on any ride footage because I just want to, you know, every time I come somewhere for the first time, I just want to be totally surprised. And um, this is what the queue looks like. We've got some paintball guns here. Um, I don't know how long the queue is, but again, this is all about 
um, Spider-Man. Believe it or not, the technology actually in this ride, you don't have like a, a gun or something similar to what you have on uh, Toy Story Mania. You actually use your hands, like, sh 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 like you're actually shooting webs. Pretty cool technology. JoJo's a huge Marvel fan, so what is this about? So basically, there is an open house tour today of the web facility. Normally, they build stuff and create stuff here. And Peter Parker is giving us a tour, and nothing's going to go wrong. Nothing. And he's not Spider-Man. No. He's Spider-Man. Just kidding, I'm Spider-Man. We are waiting now in a tiny room here for a presentation by the one and only Peter Parker. <laughs> Since we have been here for a little while, too, we've been asking the cast members how to get high scores, and they said shoot everything that's yellow. And each vehicle is going to have up to four people. And there's actually ways you can enhance your score. You just have to like buy something in the store uh, for different enhancements. Um, I think it's kind of cool. I mean, I think it's going to be like the future of technology here at Rides. You know, I mean, you can still do everything, but the, the additional attachment that they sell here is just going to help your score out um, for your, you know, enjoyment. And now we're evacing, but we do get a fast pass. It just kind of stinks. We're here for uh, 34 minutes and they have to evac. So we're going to have our ticket scanned and we'll get a fast pass to come on back. Well, that, uh, that's such a bummer, but um, let's actually check out some of the shows. I guess kind of walk around Avengers Campus now. They're having major technical uh, issues. Unfortunately, that means now we're not going to be able to try to get another one for Web Slingers at 12 because you can actually do that if you get one in the morning, then you can actually try to get another virtual pass at 12. But we could actually get a Rise of Resistance over at Disneyland if we really wanted to. The shows here in Avengers Campus is what really sets it apart from everything else. There's shows constantly going on and on and on. We're going to try to catch the next one at 10. Ready? Here you go. Woo! <laughs> Where should I go? <laughs> <laughs> that looks pretty funny, actually. Right, see you guys. <laughs> Let's check out the web slingers, the web supplies. This is where you can actually buy those additions to uh, enhance your score on the web slingers. Oh, okay. So that is not the attachment for the ride, is it? that you add to the power band. Oh, okay. And that's what you can go on the ride with? Yes. So, so right it's $24.99 and then $29? Yeah, 30 and 25 Okay. So it's a Personally, I think this is really cool. However, I don't think it's for me. Who I do think it's for, I think it's for people who come here a lot and know the, 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 the ride really well. Because if they had this at Toy Story Mania, I would love to get something like this that's going to help me get a better score and I'm, I go there so, so much. It'd be really cool to rep that on Toy Story Mania, but let me know your guys' thoughts down below. What do you think about this? It's obviously something totally different that Disney's never done and obviously, you know, it's for them to make a little bit more money, but you can get a better score. score. So if I was a regular here, I would totally get it. However, it's not for me right now. It's $54. Inside this, the store here, they actually tell you the best scores this hour, the best this day, the best this month, and that's everybody's scores totaled up in uh, the ride, which is so cool. Wow, this is a game changer. I heard something really cool is happening over here. The amazing Spider-Man. Uh, here are the times throughout the day that this event's gonna happen. Collecting quite the crowd over here. A lot of people want to see uh, Spider-Man fly. Welcome to Avengers Campus. Watch this. show attracts a lot of people. A lot of people here. Absolutely insanity. After the show, you can get photos of Spider-Man. <laughs> wow. Would not be opposed if uh, Disney decided to build a whole Marvel theme park. Let me know down below if you'd like to see that. I think it's kind of needed with the amount of people here. 
on to the next show. I think it's called Avengers Assemble, and I think it's over here. That's Captain Marvel all the way up there. Hey there. <laughs> Nice, cool little uh, stunt show. I love these pop-up shows. Yeah. It's really cool. That was about six, seven minutes, and now we can go about our day, catch another show, which is gonna happen right on over here. The Warriors of Wakanda are up next. Below are gonna be the times throughout the day where you can catch this show. But it's really nice that they, they kind of happen right after you eat each other every single hour. It's pretty awesome. They are Wakanda years. forever. I feel like I could be in uh, Avengers Campus all day. So much, so much to do. The King leaves. Uh, See you later. Wakanda forever. Wakanda forever. Hello. Hey, hey, hey. I, love I like you more than Ant Man. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, now it's time uh, for us to eat. We're gonna eat at the Pim Test Kitchen. We did order this while we were in line for uh, Web Slingers that did go down, but it's time for a mobile pickup now. Check out the mustard and ketchup. They're ginormous and same with all of the soda that goes to the soda machine over here. The only problem we're running into now, like always, is there's nowhere to eat. It's all full, all full. I didn't know there was a bar out here too. There's a bar, I'll probably have to get a nice little beer here. All right, here's a look at my meal. Um, it's a secret recipe, so I don't know what's in it. This is bread. Um, and there's syrup, there's a tiny egg, bacon. I think it's just gonna be like French toast. Um, it does have some fancy colors, so if you're a picky eater, you might not enjoy this. I also just noticed, look at this, this is my fork. I didn't notice that there was a little tiny fork on here. <laughs> I kinda wanna keep this. This is so cool. Look at this for reference. There's pretty much no room anywhere, so I'm sitting on the ground eating it right by Gardens of the Galaxy mission outbreak. This is definitely like French toast or like bread pudding. Mm. French toast. I was pretty hungry, but I only ate half of it. It's okay. It's not the best thing. It just needs a little bit more flavor, in my opinion. I'm so happy. I, I couldn't finish it. Also, Jojo was eating the leftovers. <laughs> He's just walking around with a tray. <laughs> Yo, Captain Marvel knew who I was. No, stop it. She loves me. Our next Marvel attraction, Guardians of the Galaxy Mission Outbreak, is only a 25 minute wait. Usually, this is like over an hour. All right. Don't even question it either. This is way better than Hollywood Studios Tower Tear. There's so many ups and downs and drops. It's so much better. Mm, and it's themed up Guardians of the Galaxy. We're getting scared. And presto, the doors open for you. I now present to you Tanelier Tavon's private office. My friends, you're one step closer to your exciting encounter with the Guardians of the Galaxy. That was not part of the plan. What? Of course I escaped. For those of you who have not been paying attention, the name's Rocket, one of the Guardians of the Galaxy. Woo! Here we go! Yeah! 
so much better than Hollywood Studios. We actually were on it with uh, Prince Charming Dev right here. Dude, Hi. that was so much fun. It's we amazing. We this in Orlando. We do. <laughs> you like it, Jodo? I mean, listen, it's awesome. I love that ride. It's so much fun. It's still like one of my favorites here. Right over here by Mission Outbreak, there's actually a box. This has changed every week with the new episode of Loki. It's a Loki for President. If you guys have seen the new uh, Loki, they change this every week. Next Wednesday, this will be changed for the season finale. I have to say this. I think Avengers Campus is my favorite theme area in a Disney theme park. Even better than Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. Even better than Pandora and Toy Story Land. There's something about Marvel. I mean, I love Marvel movies. It's just so, so so well done the atmosphere in here the hype it's it is it's real it's so well done everything you're just completely immersed i love avengers campus we're uh gonna head on out to recharge and then come back a little bit later also we got to get started on these videos for you guys to see we'll be back in a little bit look at this it's like we never left i did make a t-shirt change we're gonna head right to web slingers because it's actually up and running now we do have that fast pass that they gave us since it was broken down, but welcome back to California Adventure. It's like we never left. We've actually been gone for about two hours. We have made it back for a second try here at Web Slingers. Let's go on it for the first time. The nice part since we were here when it broke down, they said we don't have to wait in the actual normal line. We're actually gonna go through the fast pass. We'll scan it and they'll actually see in their system that we were here when it was down and then we can skip it. That's so kind of cool. Sweet, let's go. All right, yay. We just get to bypass the outset right there. So it's not too much, but you know, it's something. The door opens. Yay. Peter Parker. Woo! Hey, what's up? I'm Peter Parker. And here at Web, we get access to some pretty awesome tech like Vibranium from Wakanda or this crazy alien juice stuff. We have Kim Particles and Stark Tech. It all helps us develop really cool stuff like, um, like these spider bots, for example. We gotta go get all the spider bots. Remember, we gotta go for the gold slash yellow ones. Those are gonna be the high point ones. Check this out, there's uh, some lockers over here. I wonder which one is Peter Parker's. Remember, the only way that we shoot is we go pew, pew, pew. Which is crazy, I don't know how good the yeah, aiming is. Don't judge is. us on our score because we're vlogging and True, shooting, so. true. We've got some very cool 3D glasses here. Check these bad boys out. These aren't even better than Flight of Passages. How do I look? Do I look sexy? I'm so excited for this. This is gonna be incredible. I might not even vlog much because I want to have some fun, you know? Here we go. Oh my god, this is cool! Oh my god! <laughs> oh. Yeah, I'm going up! <laughs> Whoa. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. You guys stink! Behave next time! 224,000. I don't know if that's good. That was a lot, a lot of fun. I don't know if our score was high. Is that high if we wrote it? Because I think it was pretty high, like 200, like what, 45,000? And Frozo's right there. Frozo! Hey, bud! Yeah! What's up? Oh, that was great. I love that. I love the pose. I love it. You're the man. You're No, you're the man. You're the man. No, you're the man. <laughs> Woo! Silly symphonies time. Oh, oh my gosh! Woo! This is scary! Wow! <laughs> Dead! Oh my gosh, this is terrifying actually. Oh. Got myself a beer here in uh, Radiator Springs. Pretty cool background. Look who we found, everybody. Yeah, I just saw you about like three days ago. Your magic to get here is incredible. You fly in like like two minutes? Awesome, it's good to see you here again. Oh, here's the whip. Loki for president, woo! Hello. Hi, how are you? I'm ready. All right, well, hold your mobile. Thank you, guys. You're welcome. Oh, wait, I gotta, I gotta get the drinks. Yeah. Surprisingly pretty. 
Steve, we love you. Yeah. Yes. That a bud. Cheers. Woo! Jojo, it's a god of thunder. <laughs> Thor. I'll take another one, Thor. Cheers. Hey. All right, everybody. That is going to be it for your daily dose of Disney. Kind of a very long day. We've been at it since 7 a.m. in the morning. It's 8.43, so our whole 12-hour day. My voice is gone. Um, Incredible Coaster did break down, so we didn't get to go on it. But we have a whole video tomorrow on Disneyland. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. It's my very first time in the Ventures campus. It has been bananas. Real quick shout out to Bruce and Heather Murphy over my Patreon. Thank you so much for being on my Patreon. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I sure did. My voice is gone. I'll see you guys tomorrow at Disneyland. We have two more vlogs here in California Adventure. I mean, sorry, Cali, before we head back to Orlando at Disney World. But with that, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out. I love that. I love that. I was doing my outro. You guys called me over. What's up? Jump around. Jump around. Jump around. Jump up, jump up, and get down.